Although automobiles has been produced from the 1880 until the Model T was introduced in 1908, they were mostly scarce, expensive and often unreliable. Positioned as reliable, easily maintained, mass market transportation, the Model T was a great success. In a matter of days after the release, a 15,000 order has been placed. The first production Model T was built on August 12, 1908, and left the factory on September 27, 1908, at a Ford Pickett Avenue plant in Detroit, Michigan. On May 26, 1927, Henry Ford watched the 15 million model Ford roll off the assembly line at this factory in Highland Park, Michigan. Henry Ford conceived a series of cars between the founding of the company in 1903 and the introduction of the Model T. Ford named his first car the Model A and proceeded through the alphabet up to the Model T, 20 models in all. Not all the models went into production. The production model immediately before the Model T was the Model S. The follow-up to the Model T was the Ford Model A, rather than the Model U. The company publicity said this was because the new car was such a departure from the old that Ford wanted to start all over again with the letter A. The Model T has a front-mounted 177 cubic inch inline four-cylinder engine producing 20 horsepower for a top speed of 64 until 72 km per hour. According to Ford Motor Company, the Model T had full economy on the order of 11 till 18 liter per 100 km. The engine was capable of running on gasoline, kerosene or ethanol, although the decreasing cost of gasoline and the later introduction of prohibition made ethanol an impractical fuel for most users. The engines of the first 2,447 units were cooled with water pumps. The engines of unit 2,448 and onward, with a few exceptions, prior to around unit 2,500, were cooled by thermosiphon action. <laughs> 